Welcome to my channel. My name is Celine Diaz and I am a mom who is trying to get her family some financial freedom. I'm paid two times per month for my part-time job. All of my other income comes from side hustles. But today I wanted to go over my um, monthly budget for the month of November. Um, I did have to sit down and reevaluate and see what changes would be made. Um, October got us really good and um, so now I am trying to get us back on track um, you know is within reason I feel like it's important to push um, forward and try to you know reach goals and things like that but our main difference going forward for the month of November is there will be uh, credit card payments that have to be made. Um, I did use my credit card for some car expenses and um, for the funeral that I did go to. So I keep saying over and over things happened and now we have to reconcile um, our finances and figure out how we're going to make this happen. Um, so first up for our bills. Um, rent is $1,110 and um, you guys sorry about all the commotion um, utilities is $100 uh, it's usually around 90 something typically <laughs> but I like to just round it up and then if I have anything left over um, leave it in my bank account as a cushion Internet is um, same there. It's like $99 and some change, but I budget $100. Our phone is $90 every month. Car insurance is uh, $114. Renter's insurance is $13. Netflix, also $13. And Amazon, $14. So... Um, let me just make sure, um, cause I do have my notes next to me, but you know how that goes when you're just trying to prep for, um, your budget and to go over it. And typically I don't record this. Typically I just, um, do it all on my own and then, um, you, you never see it, but I figured this time I would. Um, so bills is $1,554. Um, and I'm just going to put a little asterisk there. <clears throat> Next up, we'll move on to our expenses. Now, expenses are typically envelopes that I leave at home or um, some type of expense that I don't carry around in my wallet. So the kiddo's allowance um, is $40. They typically get $5 a week each. Um, health is $10 each week, so 40 bucks total. And the same with laundry, um, only a few times have I ever pulled the laundry money out of the account and not put it directly to um, our laundry bucket. It just has quarters in it. Um, and pets, 40 bucks. Once again, $10 a week typically is what we do. So uh, 40 times 4, we're at $160 for our expenses. So, a um, couple of these I do have envelopes for, but I just don't carry them in my wallet or purse or hip pack or whatever I'm carrying at the time. Okay, and then next up is our cash envelopes. Now, these are the envelopes that I actually carry with me um, on a regular basis. So, what I've decided to do is keep all of this the same. Mommy is getting uh, $160 for the month. Gas is getting $80 for the month. Groceries, the same, $400. Now, you might be thinking, Salentia, it's Thanksgiving. What the heck are you, what are you going to do? Now, th our Thanksgiving sinking fund has $60 in it. Um, I did speak to my mother-in-law. She did inform me that we are responsible for uh, ham and also um, the dressing and I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but I'm not the greatest cook. Daniel is the cook in our family, in our household, so I'm going to be relying heavily on him. He laughed at me when I said we should get a pre-cooked ham. I mean, I just feel like 
the less work we have to do, the less stress <laughs> we'll be under. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna let him handle it. Whatever he decides, I'm fine with, as long as he stays within that $60 budget, or if he needs to go over it, it comes out of his, um, his money. <laughs> Because that's all I have right now to um, provide to our Thanksgiving dinner. Um, I am going to also recycle my decorations from last year. So unless I can dash a little bit more and put money toward uh, decorations. Anyways, moving on. Household getting $40 for the month and miscellaneous $40 for the month. So let's go ahead and add that up so we have 300 that's not right because there's already $400 right here so 160 plus 80 plus 400 plus 40 plus 40, 40. <laughs> $720 perfect all right so I'm just gonna add up what um, I say four walls, but some of these things we don't absolutely have to have on a weekly basis, but since we are trying to maintain um, some, you know, routine, we don't want to switch up too much. We just want to try to increase our income and cover the additional expenses. All right, so first I'm going to go back up to my bills um, and I know the minimum was like $30 or something like that, but I'm going to put the minimum as 46 to make this an even $1,600. I think that's, you know, month math is not all that great. <laughs> Plus 46 yes, $1,600. Okay, so then I'm just going to add the total. Um, so we have $1,600 plus $160 for our expenses. And 724 cash envelopes so we should have a total of two thousand four hundred and eighty dollars being paid to take care of our four walls now there is something else um, we get five hundred dollars for the child tax credit and we're continuing on to uh, receive it and and I don't know how things are going to look for us next year and what we're going to do then, but for now we're going to keep receiving that child tax credit. <clears throat> Excuse me. And so from the $2,480 minus the $500 from the child tax credit, my honey and I need to make sure that we come up with $1,980 for um, our four walls for the month of November. Uh, I will say this. I am working on trying to build my safety net and also um, build up my children's break time envelope. They are out for a complete week for Thanksgiving break. Um, just like I did with this past month, they were out for a week. I had some money put away so we can do things together. It may be too cold, It may we may just end up staying in and ordering pizza and things like that, but I still want to at least a few of the days have some finances uh, put aside so they can do something um, while they're out for that break. Um, the after school program they're in did mention that they are having program during that week. It is just $190 per child uh, for that week. And I'm not certain um, if I'll be able to come up with that $190 uh, per child before then. Um, I'm not going to stress myself to do so. Like I said, I'm just going to work on putting some money aside. So, um, I think that was it. Um, oh, I did want to do a giveaway. This, yeah, this video, I wanted to put the info here um, that I am doing a video, a, a giveaway, <laughs> back up, I'm doing a giveaway. So what this giveaway is, it is a surprise. I will let you know that it is a savings challenge. Um, and you're more than welcome to go check out our shop and see what we have in there, but I will say it is not uh, something that we 
offer in the shop specifically. It is something that I made special for this giveaway. It's nothing major, nothing spectacular, but still cute, but it is a surprise. So I'm hoping that whoever gets it uh, really does enjoy it. It's simple. It's obviously, you know, like I said, it's a surprise. So um, all you have to do is like this video. If you want to be entered, um, go ahead and make sure you're publicly subscribed to my channel. Okay. This video, uh, I don't know why I keep saying video, <laughs> this giveaway is only for the U.S. So um, I want to make sure that um, I mention that because I'm going to be sending this item to someone. Okay, you obviously if I'm sending it to you, you have to be willing to give your address. But down below, write, uh, type, leave the comment. <laughs> I don't know what is going on with me. Um, Thanksgiving giveaway and I will make sure that um, I'm gonna check and make sure you publicly subscribe that you mark down below Thanksgiving giveaway and um, leave your Instagram and email I knew it was something else leave your Instagram handle or your email address so I can contact the winner directly um, and I will leave the directions for the giveaway down below. Look at that. I said giveaway, not video. Yes. Okay, so I'll leave it down below the information of what to do for this giveaway. Um, I'm really excited about it just because I know that this is a time of year where we are giving, we are sharing, we are loving each other, we are supporting each other, we are trying to get our, you know, give each other a round of applause for making it through the year and coming around to the new year. Um, but anyway, that I believe is it for this video. I want to thank you all so much for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. All of the things that can keep us connected. Feel free to check out our Etsy shop, Big Cartel, and Instagram, Salentia and Cassie J Creates. I will link them all down below. But you guys, that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, good luck to all of you who decide to enter the giveaway and have an awesome day. Bye guys.